What's going on guys? We're back with the uh, goat. Today we're going to be swapping in these uh, fifth gen taillights. Here's the harness to run them. Uh, I have the conventional ones. As you can see the socket and the bulb is floating around in this one. I don't know how the hell that happened. First time I've ever seen that. So really we just unbolt, run these. Uh, this connects to my trailer plug underneath because I bought the ones that this would be amber. I just, that's how the uh, fifth gens have it. So I wanted to do it that way. It's gonna be a short video, so let's get to it. idea how this happened but that's an easy fix just unplug that and that'll plug into my new harness has anyone ever seen that before that it came apart like that like it's just floating around in there I mean, I probably could have got it out and fixed it, but this is more fun. Let's get to running these new wires. A few moments later. Okay, so I'm trying to put the first one in here. And we can see. Um, let me see if I can get that to focus. The plug right in there, you can see how it's hitting. So I'm going to have to cut just a little bit of that away. And we're gonna try using just some side cutters. Or tin snips, sorry. Let's try this. Okay, so I cut that little piece off. Just kinda eyeballed it. And now this fits in. Let's get this. Got this one all fished through on this side. Small one just goes to your signal light. This one's being a little more of a pain than the other side. I'm just gonna fish this down through the bottom hole here. And uh, you'll see the pins are offset. So it goes that way. Let's see if we can get this one in. There, a little click on that one. Just kind of tuck everything back in this hole. I don't know if you can see that. I just kind of tucked everything back in here. I cut that. Let's get this head or taillight popped in. Wipe down. Oh. Throw everything in the bed here. Looking pretty damn good. Orange is working. Sides. Let's turn the lights on, see how they look. Lights and hazard lights too, I guess. Damn, those look good. 
Let's try. Maybe I set this down on the step on the brakes and we'll see what it looks like. tie up all my wires underneath here um, and then I'll wrap this video up so I got all finished up here and we'll uh here's what we have uh, I was gonna run through the lights here quick for you got the outer parts on right both sides looking good that's like a left signal right would be the same it's uh yellow that'll be orange um I guess amber so it's flashing amber right now. Weird thing is, uh, I came back and tried this again. I came back and I put the four ways on again. And they're flashing red now. And there was a box in the wiring, which is now clicking. This, I just tied everything up under here. So this box, yeah, that's clicking now. And that's what makes it flash red. Just tied everything up under here. Ran it up there, did the same thing, followed the original wiring here, up under there. Got a train horn tucked up under here, so it's a little bit close. Like this is where you unplug for your trailer connector and it gets us power. But uh, we're gonna live dangerously here for a second. We even got those LED reverse lights. The only issue is back in park. Don't mind all the codes and everything. For some reason we have a signal light out and a signal light out and parking light out. I don't know what that's all about. So uh, I think I'm gonna end this video here. I'm going to grab my computer and Alpha OBD and set my taillights to LED that fixes it I'll just put that in the next video or actually I'll put it probably down in the comments whether or not that fixed it but uh thanks for watching